Wagwan, you know, see, see, class, please, girl, don't come in on my place if you're not beat. Make sure you're on your arm shape. One go for me. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to get in the kitchen to record a video for you guys. Originally, I was trying to make an omelet, but it became an epic fail. If you guys wanna see the process of this whole thing, then stay tuned. So right here are our list of ingredients that I was gonna to use to make my omelet. Um, but it turned out to be some cheesy eggs. So right here, I'm just gonna show you guys really quickly what I have. So I have some pepper jack cheese that I ended up not using. I have some singles American cheese. I have three eggs, salt and black pepper, some chicken Vienna sausages, the hot and spicy ones from Grace. I have one onion, a red bell pepper and a green bell pepper, and of course, some butter. So right here is an overview of all the chopped ingredients that I was using. I used half of the onion, I used one fourth of the green bell pepper, and then I also used one fourth of the red bell pepper. As for the sausages, I just cut them like that. I used about five. I literally thought that this was gonna be epic, but like I said, epic fail. And then right here, we have the three eggs. So when it comes to making eggs, I always remove the little white foamy things that you see stretched from the eggs. In Jamaica, we call it the eye of the egg. If I'm baking something, if I'm making eggs of any sort, I always remove them. So right here, I'm just showing you guys the process of how I remove it. So the next step of this whole process is me beating the eggs them bad. You know, I have to whisk it together. So nothing special, I'm just whisking away here. Now I'm just melting down some butter. I'm adding in two tablespoons of butter to begin what I thought was gonna be some magic, but yeah, I'm still pissed off about that. But here we are just melting down the butter and once that's melted down fully, we're just gonna start the whole process. The next step is adding in the red bell peppers followed by the green bell peppers and then finally the chopped onion. The next step is moving on to sauteing everything together for a bit before we add the sausage as the final part. I really wanted this omelet so bad y'all. Like I really wanted a western omelet but I didn't have no ham and then I also didn't have no shredded cheese so I kind of knew this was going to be a fail from the get but here I am wasting my time. Right now I'm just allowing the veggies to just saute for about a minute. They were smelling so good. Now that that minute is over, we're just gonna mix everything all together before we add the sausages in, which I'm about to do right now. As always, when I cook, I'm just combining all the flavors together and just mixing in the sausage so it could get done a little bit. All right, so here comes the beginning of the end. I'm adding in the eggs right now. I really thought that this was gonna be epic, y'all. This was so bad. But yeah, I'm just adding in the eggs, piling it on, kinda thick. So I knew it was gonna be runny in the middle, and I knew it was probably gonna break apart, but I was still hoping for the best. Next, I'm following up with adding in some black pepper, sprinkle it all over. Then I'm adding in a little bit of salt. For a second, I thought that things were gonna look up, you know, it was looking nice. It was getting thick under the bottom. So I was just like, all right, you know, I think I might have a chance with this omelet, but I'm about to show y'all where things just went from bad to worse. Like if I didn't have shredded cheese, I should have just not even try with this omelet. I don't know what possessed me if it means up the people them cheese like this. Like it's supposed to be held together for a reason. I don't know why I took the people them sliced cheese and mince it up. But here I go. I'm about to try and layer this cheese onto this egg real quick. Look look at look at this. So at this point, I just knew that, you know, 
it was just not gonna work this wasn't gonna be an omelet this was just gonna be some cheesy ass eggs yep that's exactly what this turned out to be so i'm just here playing around with the corners trying to see if i could finesse you know a flip but as y'all can see the struggle was definitely real So here comes the worst part of this whole thing. So I tried to flip it and this is the result. It was definitely too wet, but then I tried to flip it again. Like why? This thing was already a failure and I was really trying to finesse it still, but I guess I have me a big ass blob of cheesy eggs. So I just ended up flipping it over one more time so that it wasn't as runny and it wasn't as wet. And then I just left it how it was because yeah, like I said, a failure. I can't do nothing about it. Either I'm gonna throw it in the garbage or I'm just gonna see how it tastes. So here I am tasting my cheesy eggs, which was supposed to be an omelet, but it is what it is. Even though this was a fail, do not kill me in the comments and be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you're subscribed, turn that notification bell on, and I'll see you in the next video.